the LG V20 user hit and today I'm doing a video on the Moto Z3 guys so Motorola has announced the Moto Z3 today um so I'm on their uh I'm on their blog page and we're looking at the press release of the Moto Z3 so as you guys can see right there it says Motorola connects you to 5G first so um there's the Moto Z3 right there front and back um, it has a 5G motor mod on there, so this phone will be capable of 5G when it is uh, when it's available. Um, as you guys can see right there on the back of the mod, it has 5G and it has Verizon logo. So this is going to be a Verizon exclusive smartphone. So when, when Verizon launches 5G, the Moto Z3 will be capable of taking advantage of the 5G network from Verizon. So let's check this out. All right, guys. This is so it says a first 5G upgraded phone. So that's a definite plus right there. It says earlier. It says earlier this year we celebrated 45 years of major mobile moments from the world's first portable cell phone to the iconic razor to the launch of the Moto Z family and our revolutionary modular technology Moto Mods. Motorola is a leading innovation in the mobile industry. We are making history again as the first manufacturer to connect mobile consumers with a 5G network using our Moto Mod technology. With up to 10 times with up to 10 times the speed of today's wireless technology, lower latency and higher bandwidth, access to 5G networks will strengthen mobile connectivity and radically improve the smartphone experience. Get ready for uninterrupted 4K live streaming and video chatting, lag free gaming and VR experiences, and fastest download speeds over. 5G will make using smartphones dramatically faster and smoother for consumers and enable businesses to empower their employees with greater efficiency and productivity on the go. 5G will even bring them to 5G will even bring to life new and exciting experiences not yet conceived. So 5G is 5G is gonna be the shit. Basically, 5G is gonna be the fucking shit. It's basically, gonna be 10 times faster than LTE, uh, I believe. So that's good. Um, so this motor mod thing from Motorola is a definite win. Um, it's an interesting concept if you ask me that's the most in interesting thing about this phone is a 5G motor mod um, so once Verizon launches at 5G that Moto Z3 player can take advantage of it right then and there so thumbs up to Motorola and Verizon for that let's keep going shall we um, after two years of expanding smartphone capabilities with better photography, sound, battery life, and more, Motorola is excited to unleash the full potential of the Moto Mods platform by delivering the first to market technology with 5G. Say hello to the new Moto Z3 and 5G Moto Mod. When paired with the mod, Moto Z3 is the first is the world's first smartphone with access to Verizon's 5G network delivering a new beginning for indulging in video, connecting home devices, working remotely in gaming and AR and VR. Motorola also partnered with Qualcomm to achieve this industry milestone utilizing the flagship Snapdragon X50 modem and millimeter wave components so this Moto Z3 I guess has a Snapdragon processor it says X50 so I don't know what that means I guess it will tell us endless possibilities with 5G building upon our deep history and innovation our intent to put meaningful technology in consumer hands as soon as it's ready to ready and never stop looking for new ways to deliver the best mobile devices on the planet. Today we are t taking mobile technology to the next level by not only transforming the device but also 
what fuels it. Downloading with 5G, watch your favorite shows with no interruption. That's a one. These days, everything from eating to watching movies is on the go. In fact, over 50% over of uh, millennials prefer to watch video content on their smartphone. With the new 5G network, as you move millions, when you move million miles an hour and travel more than ever, you can download the latest season of your favorite show in HD in minutes before your airplane takes off. Mobile viewing with 5G never miss a goal when watching from your phone. Okay. <clears throat> During the World Cup, a total of 486 million attempts were made to stream the games, but 93 million of them were unsuccessful due to streaming errors and slow start times. On a 5G network, watch live games without any delay and avoid the crowds and bad noise and bad news bleed seats at the stadium. In the future, 5G will enable immersive VR so you can get a courtside view right from home. Sharing with 5G, craft the perfect vacation shot and share it with your friends and family instantly. It is so important that you have access to a network you can rely on to upload your favorite moments from vacation. With the 5G network, you can upload and send 300 vacation photos to family back home in the time it takes to make the perfect Mai Chi, the Mai Tai or whatever, I think it's Mai Tai. When traveling in the future, when traveling in the future, the 5G network will enhance your experience by enabling natural language translation in real time. This will, this will allow you to speak with international tour guides, hotel concierge, and new friends with ease. Gaming with 5G. Play all night with a consistent connection. The 5G network would the 5G network reduces lag and buffering for augmented and virtual reality. Experience and a smoother experience means that the possibilities are endless. In 2019, it is projected that 40% of the U.S. customers will use augmented reality apps on their mobile devices. 5G will enable a world where your kids are interacting with lifelike superheroes in the park with VR glasses education with 5G learn outside the classroom with over 88% of K through 12 students using a smartphone to do schoolwork at least once a week and 64% of college students using a smartphone for coursework and school related tasks students can use the AR to travel to a historic to a historical monument to live notable speeches and collaborate on projects with students around the globe world in real time 5G will deliver Martin Luther King Jr's I have a dream speech with continuous connectivity and reduced buffering so you can hang on to every last word so um yeah he, there's a lot of features in this phone guys it's all about 5G, but this friends are all about 5G, and that's not wrong with that. It's all about 5G right now, man. Says the next generation of Mini Z. Says the new Mini Z3 Pro features a 6 inch Max version 4HD Plus OLED display with an expensive 18 by 9 aspect ratio with all day 3000 mAh battery, dual depth sensing smart camera system with Google Lens built in. Mini Z3 Pro maintains our pure Android experience. Cutting down the unnecessary apps and bloatware, and including the latest software with Android Oreo. And we have gone one step further with Moto experiences the stream, the streamless, the seamless, the, the seamless integration of hardware and software makes 
interacting with your smartphone more fun and intuitive than ever with fast and easy shortcuts to the features you use most. So they gave us some of the specs right there. Um, it has a 6 inch display, it's Full HD Plus. Uh, it's an OLED display there, so that's pretty good, I guess. Um, 3000 mAh battery, 18 by 9 screen, uh, Android 8.1 Oreo. Um, it has the Moto Actions and all that on there. Um, they don't give us a lot of specs. I'm gonna say 64 GB of RAM and 4 GB of RAM. Uh, the processor is a Snapdragon processor from, from Qualcomm in here. Uh, it says Snapdragon X50, so I don't know what that means. So I don't know if it's Snapdragon. I doubt it's Snapdragon 450. I doubt it. I I doubt that this one has a 450 because the Z3 Play has a 636 on it. So this might have 650 Snapdragon. Maybe I don't know. Availability and pricing. This is the guys. This is probably the thing that you guys want. Uh, Moto Z3 Play will be available in the U.S. exclusively through Verizon, starting on August 16th. So the Moto Z3 is on Verizon only in the U.S. It will be in the in in it will be an exclusive smartphone to Verizon, which will be available at Verizon Wireless on August 16th, which is two weeks from today, for 20 bucks a month for 24 months. On Verizon's device payment, 480 retail, 480 retail. So that's to so the Moto Z3 is 480, which isn't bad. Um, says so zero percent APR to make it easier to move to 5G. We're offering up to $300 off a new Moto Z3 on our device payment plan when you switch to Verizon and trade in your old phone. So if you guys uh, switch to Verizon and you trade in your old phone, you can get the uh, Moto Z3 for 180, which is a great deal at that price. It says the 5G Moto Mod will be available in the U.S. exclusively in early 2019. So the Moto Mod will not be able will not be available at launch, guys. Obviously, because 5G is not out just yet. Um, when the Verizon launches 5G, I'm assuming in 2019, I guess. Uh, the Moto Mod should be available to purchase. So at launch, guys, the Moto Z3 will be available August 16th. The 5G Moto Mod will not be available just yet. You guys have to wait for the uh, Moto Mod to be released in 2019, early 2019 for the 5G Mod. So do keep that in mind. So yeah, so it's coming out August 16th to Verizon. It's $20 a month for 24 months. It's 480 retail, which isn't bad. Um, if you guys are switch to Verizon and trade in your smartphone, you can get the Moto Z3. For up to 20, you can get the Moto Z3. If you switch to Verizon and trade in your smartphone, you can get the Moto Z3 play on Verizon's payment plan, $300 off. So I guess it'd be 180, so which isn't bad at all for this phone. The specs on this phone are pretty good. Um, if you guys know the specs on the uh, uh the um the Z3 Play, it should be similar specs. Um, th that's what the phone looks like front and back. It looks like the Meta Z3 Play, but. Uh, this one, the Moto Z3, is on the Verizon only, and they'll have a 5G Moto Mod available in only 2019. Uh, the Moto Z3 Play is not on the Verizon, and they will never make its way to Verizon. The Moto Z3 Play is available on Sprint and US Cellular, and you guys can bring the Moto, you guys can bring an unlocked Moto Z3 Play to Boost Mobile. If you guys want to do that, bring an unlocked Moto Z3 Play to Boost Mobile and use it there. So that's pretty cool. And you obviously can uh, use an online Moto Z3 Play on any GSM carrier like T-Mobile, AT&T, uh, Cricket, AT&T Prepaid, Metro PCS, T-Mobile, Symbol Mobile, and others. Uh, this phone, like it has a lot of features in it, but its main feature of this phone, guys, it's 5G modem. That's the main feature of this phone. 
Oh, so once you guys buy the phone and you guys get the motor mod, 5G will be available to you when Verizon launches it next year, I guess in 2019, I guess. Uh, so the motor mod will not be available at launch, so keep that in mind. So uh, the motor mod will be out in early 2019, so be on the lookout for that. Uh, I am curious to see how this motor mod will work. I'm curious to see how it will work. Um, as you guys can see on the back, that it has 5G and it has Verizon logo on the back. Um, so this one looks very nice. Like I said, it looks like the Moto Z3 Play, but I don't know what the difference is between the two phones. Well, the Moto the Moto Z3 is upgradable to 5G. The Moto the Moto Z3 Play is not. And I also heard. Oh man, hold on. I think the Moto Z2, the Moto Z3 Play might be upgradable, might be upgraded to 5G as well, might be. But that's not a Verizon exclusive phone. The Moto Z3 Play is not on Verizon, and I don't think they'll get the Z3 Play because they got the Z3 coming out in two weeks from today. Um, the Moto Z2 line from Verizon will also have the 5G capability as well. So you guys got the Moto Z2 Force, the Moto Z2. To the Mersey 2 Droid Edition or whatever that would be 5G capable as well. So shout out to Verizon on that and Motorola and the Lenovo. So yeah, this is pretty cool. Uh, this one's me 480, which isn't bad. Um, the specs on it, I know some of the specs on it, but I don't. I think that I think it has 64 gigabytes of memory and 4 gigabytes of RAM. I think so. Um, it gave us some of the specs and this. Uh, in this press release, it gives some of the specs, but the uh, cameras I don't know what the cameras are. The dual cameras on back, there might be the same cameras on the uh, Moto Z3 Play. So, if you guys know what the specs are on the Moto Z3 Play, the specs should be similar to that one that it is on this phone, except for this one has 5G motor mod on it, so that one will cost you separate for that. So, uh yeah guys, so the Moto Z3 Play has been announced by Motorola. It's been released in two weeks on Verizon Wise as an exclusive on August 16th for $20 a month for 24 months. Uh, it's 480 full retail, 480 uh, If you guys trade in your smartphone and switch to Verizon, you guys can get $300 off the Moto Z3 on a, on a, on a, on a, on a payment plan. So be 180 for this phone which is not it's a great deal for that price I think the Moto Z3 Play when it was released was 499 so this is actually a bit cheaper than the Moto Z3 Play so and this one has 5G motor mod to it so thumbs up for that so uh, yeah this is probably a long video guys so um you know, if you guys stuck around to the whole video, hashtag Moto Z3. If you guys stuck around, hashtag Moto Z3. And yeah, are you guys excited about this one? Are you guys gonna get this phone from Verizon? Are you guys uh, will you guys switch to Verizon just for this phone right here? And like I said, if you guys switch to Verizon and trade in your smartphone, you guys can get the Moto Z3 for three three hundred dollars off. So that's a plus. So uh. Yeah, so if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, guys. It really helps me out a lot. Peace, rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video, and I'll get you guys in the next one. Peace out.